I just did one eye. Let me zoom in so you guys can see. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the other eye and then we'll do the face makeup. Then we'll do the face makeup. So the first thing I did with this other eye is um, use the concealer. I use the concealer, the Laura Mercier. Pretty much as like my primer. And I already did my eyebrows off camera as well. Um, let's see. So I used one color out of the Beauty um, Killer Palette from Jeffree Star Cosmetics. Um, I used the shade Courtney, which is right there for like a transition shade. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and go in with the Morphe M513. and just put that in the crease. So I'm using two different Anastasia palettes today. I'm gonna to go in with a Modern Re Renaissance palette. I'm gonna use Burnt Orange, again, for the crease color. And then I'm gonna go in with Red Ochre from the same palette. And I'm gonna put that in the outer corner. And then outer corner and then into the crease as well. And then I like to dab around, like um, we use Love Letter, Venetian Red. It should look like this right now. So we're gonna cut the crease a little bit. And I'm just gonna put it on like this. And then I look up. And then when you look up, it already kind of cuts that crease for you. Use like a thinner, like a flat brush. Um, the, it's from Morphe as well. Pretty much all my brushes are from Morphe, the M213. And then I'm just gonna blend in that concealer. And then with the um, Soft Glam palette from ABH, I'm gonna go in with um, Rose Pink, and that color is right there. The pretty color right there, Rose Pink. And I'm just gonna use my finger just to apply. Well, let me clean off my finger. <laughs> Somehow, I think I got the hell? I got eyeliner on my finger. Okay, go in with the rose pink and just put it on where you put the concealer at. And if you can't do your lid due to like like longer nails, just use like a flat brush. That way you can get in those certain areas where it's definitely harder um, with nails. That way you don't poke yourself in the eye because uh, that would hurt. And I am wearing a shirt. I'm wearing like a tube top. So, and then so the first time I was doing with like with the glitter um, with the Stila. I'm gonna use this one. The Stila. Um, it's in smoldering satin. I went to go like for the crease and it was like so bulky. So I kind of went in 
Um, hopefully, I should use another flat brush for detail, but I don't think I have another one. So let's not breathe and do. Let's do this. <laughs> if anything, I'll just use concealer. No biggies. Just makeup, right? I'm gonna go ahead and go um, do my eyeliner um, off camera and then once this um, glitter dries, I'm gonna put um, Midnight Cowboy from um, Urban Decay on top of where I put that um, Stila glitter as well. I'll be right back. Okay, so I did my liner and then I did the rest of the glitter and then I added um, some lashes. I'm using the Coco, um, the Coco Lashes in Queen, Queen B. Um, let's see. And then I want to go ahead and prep the skin. So let me get... So um, in my last video, um, for I like to use hydrating um, anti-aging serum from Vital C from Image. So I'm going to use a few pumps of that. Like I said before, it smells so good. What is this? Oh. Okay, so skin is hydrated. And then I'm gonna go ahead and with the Max Stro cream, I have like the mini mini size that right here foundation I'm gonna use the Dior don't look at the top it's really nasty um the forever foundation where's my holy grail brush I'm gonna go in with the Morthy Gonna go in with the Morphe M439 and about three pumps. And then just apply it to the skin. And this foundation is lighter, so I'm gonna go ahead and mix it, so don't worry. Mix it with like a darker one. I like to go over my lips because it cancels out the redness that I have. Like compared to my body. Go down the neck. Let's go ahead and mix this other foundation because I'm looking like a ghost. I'm gonna use the Makeup Forever HD foundation and Y354. So the Dior foundation is like um, a light to medium coverage HD foundation. You can build this up to full medium, probably to full coverage. Still looking a little light. Um, could be because of my ring light, but so we'll contour and then um, that should help even out the skin and you know make it even to the body. Gonna go in with the Wet n Wild makeup stick contour in Call Me Maple. Gonna go in with the same brush. Mm -hmm. 
And then we'll go in with the um, Laura Mercier, oh, what's this called? I always forget. The Flawless, Flawless Fusion. I'll use a Beauty at Blender. Then we're going to set this um, concealer with the air spun. A little bit on the forehead too if you get oily there. And like I, I don't like to go all the way down here because I'm going to put powder on that anyways like the for the highlighter so I don't need powder on top of powder like all these powders. Um, I want to leave that powderless. Okay. And then so I was like where's my bronzer and I have my bronzer in my hand anyways I'm using it as my mirror. So I'm going to go into the MAC Give Me Sun bronzer. summer we want to look extra bronzy give us that helmet that bronzer helmet I really don't use like blush I would like pretty much sweep my bronzer over If there's any blushes that you guys recommend for me to try out, let me know in the comment section down below so I can try those ones out. Um, maybe you guys can sway me and start having me using blushes. Kind of just go down the body. Okay, and then for highlighters, I'm gonna use the ABH Omrezzy. Um, highlighter and I'm gonna use the the setting brush from real techniques looks like this I'm gonna go out with burnt orange and do my bottom. Then for lower lashes, I'm gonna do the uh, Man Eater by Tarte mascara. I'm just gonna blend since my lashes are pretty much dry. I'm gonna um, put mascara on the top and then put mascara on the bottom. As we make that ugly face. <laughs> I'm gonna go back in with that highlighter and do some touch-ups on my shoulder. You know we gotta be extra. I 
All right, and then we're gonna go in with the Tatcha Luminous Dewy Skin Mist to finish off the base. And then for lip liner, I'm going to use the MAC Strip Down. Lip liner. And then go in with the Kylie um, Cosmetics Naked. Okay guys, so this is the finished look. You for sure can wear this out at night if you have an event to go to or you know, pretty much anything. Or if you just wanna to go to the grocery store, by all means, pull this look off. Like, or any type of other glamorous look if you wanna to go to the store or anything like that. I mean, I, I, I think I would. So please um, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Um, my name is Makeup Beauty 93. If you could hit that bell that's um, to the right um, hand side of your screen, that way every time I post, um, it'll come up and then um, it'll help out so much. Um, this is pretty much, I guess you can say my third video. So sorry my voice is a little raspy as well, but I still wanna make some content. So let's um, support each other. Um, let me know any looks you want me to create and thank you for watching.